Church Tech Weekly presents NAM 2014, brought to you by Church Tech Arts, your source for everything related to live production in the church. Visit our website at churchtecharts.org. All right, continuing our NAM 2014 coverage here, we've come over to the uh, Behringer booth. And, uh, you know, it's really funny. When I first saw the Behringer X32, uh, a lot of people said that they would never buy it because, well, it's a Behringer and Behringers are junk and you wouldn't want to buy a Behringer. And I said, you know, it's a good console. And if they had put a Midas logo on it and charged $5,000 for it, people would buy the console. Well, I'd be, I give you the M32, which is an X32 with a Midas logo on it, and it's $5,000. So you might be wondering, what does that extra $1,500 get you? Well, a couple of things. First of all, you get actual Midas preamps. So the X32 has Midas-inspired preamps. These are supposed to be actual Midas preamps. Whether or not you'll hear the difference, I don't know. But that's what they say. Uh, you get actual Midas faders. And I can tell you, these do feel better than the Behringer X32 faders. Uh, so the faders are a little bit nicer. As you can see, they've kind of tilted the, the control surface up, which is really kind of nice. It actually makes it feel a lot bigger and a lot more usable than the X32, even though the X32 has a good form factor, tilting it up this way is actually a really nice improvement. I'm very happy with this. They've kind of improved all of the uh, knobs. All the buttons are rounded. They've got little nice blue lights on them when you press them. Um, so the overall interface is just a little bit softer, a little bit more modern, a little bit nicer, a little more premium. Um, Everything else is the same. The scribble strips, the input count, the buses, all the processing, all the I.O. on the back, exactly the same as the X32. The software, exactly the same as the X32. My guess is the X32 iPad software would probably control this thing exactly the same. So, you know, you've got a little bit of an improvement here. I think it's uh, ergonomically, I think this is really nice. Um, I don't know if they've done any quality control improvements on the inside of it or if it's exactly the same. Um, but, you know, for a little higher priced uh, unit, very, very nice. And incidentally, they've also lowered the price of the X32. So it's a couple hundred dollars cheaper all the way through the line. They knocked a couple hundred dollars off. So great, uh, another great console from the Behringer Midas Group. And uh, it'll be interesting to see if they extend this line like they have the X32 line and come up with the producer version, the smaller rack mount versions and that sort of thing. So you never know, but the M32 from Midas uh, you can visit their website to see more, I'm sure.